सो हेलो गाइज एंड वेलकम बैक टू एंड्रॉइड गेम डेवलपमेंट इन यूनिटी थ्री जी सीरीज सो इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो वी हैव लर्न हाउ टू डाउनलोड एंड इंस्टॉल यूनिटी थ्री डी इन योर विंडोज पी सी सो इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू एक्सटेंड दैट टॉपिक एंड वी आर गोइंग टू क्रिएट आवर फर्स्ट गेम डिवेलपमेंट प्रोजेक्ट एंड वी विल गेट नो हाउ अबाउट द यूनिटी थ्री जी टूल हाउ टू यूज दिस टूल अफेक्टिवली and we'll get a knowledge about the menus and the tabs and uh, all the features provided by this unity 3d tool so if you are new to our channel then it is a request to please subscribe to our channel because we have been bringing a lot of free courses material and content for you so stay tuned and watch the video till the end so guys now let's launch the unity so we have the unity hub as discussed in the previous video this tool provides the same place for downloading the packages and for creating the project and for tutorials and community sections so as you can see here in the project we have no project we are going to create in a while and in the learn section we have the projects already created by the unity we can learn from here and we can also follow the tutorials for making the games in community section we can get the news from the community and we can get the answers from the unity developers who are already working on the unity and in the install section we can see the versions of unity 3d we have installed currently we have 2020 model already installed in it we can install as many version as possible in our pc but for the moment for learning purpose it is okay to download uh, the latest recommended version of unity so come back to the projects and from here we are going to create the new project click new and unity has uh, presented different templates these are already uh, templates for uh, jump starting uh, the development of game so we have 2d 3d high definition rendering project and universal render pipeline so we will uh, cover each and every template in coming uh, videos but for the moment select the 3d templates and from here we will write the name of our project hello world game and click on create the project so unity will take some time to get the things ready for the development let's wait a while so guys unity has uh, launched uh, the complete project which we just have created and from here it will feel confusing at the first uh, glance uh, you can see a lot of menus tabs and buttons and windows which are open here so these are the easy things and at the end of this video you will have enough uh, knowledge and familiarity with these tools so just start from the left hand side we can see uh, the tab which is called the hierarchy and in hierarchy section we can see the scenes and the game object so these are the game objects by selecting the game objects these are selected in the scene and in the same way we have another object which is called directional light and these game objects and the scenes are present in some defined hierarchy here and you can see here and on the right hand side we can see the scene tab here so scene is basically the placements of your game object you can choose uh, the game object you can place it and you can create as many game object in your game in this scene windows if you see on the left top side you can see different tools here when i'm going to select this hand tool now i can drag this scene as much as possible so we can place different objects different things at different places here and by this gyroscope we can see x y and z axis so you can see here our objects are lost when i'm going to double click on it it will set the center of our tool so when i'm going to select this move tool now with this tool i can move my object to desired location in the same way i can select the directional light game object to any place by this moving tool so this is our rotate tool by rotate tool i can rotate the light and and the object in along with specific axis so when i'm going to rotate it it will control the light in my game or control the light on specific object 
So in the same way, on the right hand side of the scene, we have uh, the game windows. So this game window is the live preview of game. And this is uh, the final game that your game will look like this. And when I'm going to click this play button, I can see the game in action. Currently, we have nothing in this game except two objects. So we are seeing this straight game scene here. And on the right hand side, we have the inspector tool. So inspector tool is used to control uh, the properties of an object. Suppose we have in scene, we have this light object when I'm going to select this directional light. Now I can control change the properties of this uh, directional light object. So from here, we can change the position, rotation and scaling. We can also change the color of this light, etc. In the same way for the main camera, we can also control its properties from the inspector tool. So we have a lot of properties to control and we will control each property in coming section. So on the left bottom side, we have the project tab. So all our asset scenes are reflected in this project tab. So we can see different uh, folders, files, assets, sprites, uh, different backgrounds of our games, objects of our games here. So when I'm going to select the asset and show in folder, we can see all the things present in our project from here. So on the right side, we have the console. So console is basically uh, used to uh, present the errors and the warnings in our project. We can see the logs for uh, the application crashes. If our game crashes, we can see the logs here and we can get the idea where is something wrong. We have here errors, we have the warnings and we have the information. From here, we can see the different errors or different um, warnings coming from our project. So we can also place the logs here and we can debug our games. So in the same way on the top right side, we can see the layout. So from the layout, we can change the appearance of this tool by selecting two by three. We can see the placement of the windows along specific direction. So you can choose any layout by which you are comfortable. And we can see the tall here. And this is the default coming from the beginning of this project. So you can select, it's up to you, it's up to your comfort to select the specific layout for the development of the game. And we can also drag and drop the desired tab at our desired location here. So I am going to place it where I have picked. So guys, this was the brief introduction and the creation process of uh, the game project. And in the coming section, we will dig into more details and we will cover specific topics for the game development. So hope you have enjoyed the video. This surely have given you an idea that uh, how to control the appearance and how to use this tool effectively. So this is enough for this session. See you in next video.